Hi and welcome to another view. Today you join me on a, another quick uh, product review. Uh, something that I wanted for a little while and just one of those you put off and then ask somebody to get you it at Christmas. Um, especially coming into the new year. Uh, there's a lot of natural venues that we want to fish where we're using ground bait. Although not a, a full <laughs> bucket full. But uh, especially ever seen this summer when we're fishing down the edge and things like that. Um, so I'll just jump straight into it. This is uh, comes as a set, and the reason I wanted this set over the other, not just because it's Preston and it matches, is uh, the fact that it's got the different attachments uh, that I need. Um, I used to have a riddle; it's rusted and dead. Um, so the bucket itself comes with a riddle, which obviously fits on top perfect and is part of the kit that you really need uh, when you're passing these ground baits especially when you're wanting to get them even distributed with that water comes with a, a nice top so if you're going onto the river you can stick all your bait in there and you've got a lid on it you can carry it down to the river you can have your pat lunch in there whatever you want but the main part which i'm just lift that down there is like everything nowadays is what you can attach to your box now i'm a, a big fan obviously of the uh, quick release systems as you all know and i'm sure there's lots of her um so this obviously it's brand new to a bit stiff but this is part of that quick release system that preston have for nearly every attachment that probably every attachment that we've got so normally i'd have my side tray there it's probably going to go on my front leg um so they come with the uh, the usual inserts for 25 mil and above legs and different shapes i obviously take them out for my 36 mil mill leg and this will stay on my box i'll turn it down uh, to go with the other ones but that'll stay on my box and effectively it'll go into there and it'll able to sit on nicely and then the bowl will able to sit on just perfectly right next to me um, and you can obviously move that around if i want it closer or far away or if i want it on this side i can move that about i've actually i've I do think there's an I've got another one here where I, th I fit my ripple bar on and judging by the a quick sight of it it's highly probable that that's a similar a similar size um, square to it yep which it is so it is it is compatible with uh, your ripple bar or certainly the double ripple bar that I've got to put my uh, pole socks on that obviously interchanges with it which is really good and you know sometimes it, it might be a case of you're going to attach it on this side but you might just have it here if you're on a canal or you're on a river and you can ball all your balls up and if you're going to throw them in by hand if you're doing a short line if you, even if you're doing your pole and you want to put them into your pot it's easy to set up with and it's it, it, you know even if you want to fish shallow you can have this set sort of right in between your legs like that you get yourself come through the pole and your baits if you like if you're fishing sloppy sloppy paste which is something that we're going to fish next year um through the layers where you're picking it up and throwing it in then this is a perfect scenario and with it obviously being a circular leg you can angle that perfectly i'm perfectly comfortable to sit like that i could rest it on my knee i could move it around to this side if i wanted uh, and take it out for example let's pull it out of that one push it back into this one so i'm obviously left-handed so you might say oh it's not comfortable with your legs you you want to rest it on so if i get comfortable on my box and i want to uh, fish my pole double under like that i can pick up throw in pick up throw in pick up throw in no problem whatsoever then if if i didn't tighten it too much i can just move it out of my leg net the fish it's not everybody's cup of tea but it's just showing you a few varieties of ways of doing it and this is the good things about having these little attachments and things to the box um which i i i you know i've had lots of different boxes as you know as you know different boxes and different manufacturers and, and there's some great stuff from each manufacturer i just really get on with the attachments so even when i've had reeves and i've had other matrix boxes i normally always use the preston attachments that's just purely my favorite ones to to fish with i'm not saying it's the, the, the for other people that might prefer others uh, i'm gonna just show you a little bit closer uh, with the bowl so like i said it comes with a riddle it's sort of a medium gauge riddle any it's standard size so whatever other thinner riddles and maggot riddles and you know ones for pinkies and things like that you could swap them in and out this is just a standard grade um riddle 
you can do that for whatever it also fits onto the side one so if you're just doing a small amount and you want to riddle it through or you're mixing it in your bucket and you just want to riddle it through into here you're only doing a kilo or even two kilo that would fit straight through and into that one um, like i was saying deep bowls the everybody's got a variation of these i've got a guru one as well um but lids fit on nice and you can take those take those down to the bank side if you're on river if you're on canal and and, and it's just it makes it easier sometimes you've got your rods in your hand you can carry that in your other hand you got a lot of gear in there just to hold down while you've got your satchel on your bag to walk up and down if it chucks it down the rain you've got a, a tub and and if you've not got waterproof and you get caught in it you put your phone inside your wallet inside it's going to keep that dry as well so just a little rundown on that preston i've seen it in different uh, scenarios i think my mother-in-law got me it for Christmas, I reckon it were about 35, I think I showed her on Amazon where she managed to get it for, but it, it does fluctuate between 35 and upwards of 42, but it is uh, good quality stuff and um, will last you a lot of time if you look after it. So, uh, hope you, hopefully uh, this is just give you a little bit of insight um, and we'll be back on the bank soon, just uh, getting a bit of time and uh, we'll, uh, we'll hopefully see you there. But um, enjoy your, your new year and uh, have, a uh, have a really good one. And if, you, if, if we've put this up after New Year's, I hope, hope you did have a good one. And uh, thanks a lot for watching as always and the support. Tight lines.